How do you want to be powered by sand? A town in Finland is using a giant sand battery to heat their town in the winter. This just got deployed. Essentially, it's this device that's just a big silo full of sand and pipes, and it gets heated up by renewable energies. Sand is really good at maintaining heat without breaking down as a material. So they can heat this thing up to extreme temperatures and it just kind of stays there. So during the sunny and warm months, they can use renewable energy to heat this thing up and it can stay hot throughout the winter and heat the entire town. Not like emanating heat from the one place, but there are pipes in it that can then take air, heat it up and deliver it to places. That's rad. And like there have been heat storage systems before, but this is sand. Like it's pretty available and pretty cheap. There's still drawbacks. It's mostly good for heating. It's, it's a lot worse to try to convert that back into electricity. It's not very efficient that way, but still a single big thing of sand to heat a whole town. I'm genuinely floored by like, I had to double, triple and quadruple check because they're saying it can hold the heat for months at a time. That just, I can't reconcile that in my head. I guess the point is who needs classic batteries when you can just use sand? Except um, let's go back to classic batteries. You are most likely familiar with lithium ion batteries, which power most consumer electronics. They're those good, good batteries that every once in a while explode. It just makes for a little, it's just, it's just a little fun. You know, it's a little side thing it does. So inside lithium ion batteries is sort of like power sludge. They are good, but mostly they suck and they blow up. So let's talk about how ion storage systems is working on a solid state battery that shows some serious promise. This is a Maryland based company that is working on a solid state battery. The idea is that instead of having that power goo, you just have like a brick of battery material that just holds power, like a power crystal. They should call them power crystals. If you need a marketing person, talk to me. Yo, they're power crystals, not batteries. So they're working on these power crystals and they could be potentially up to 50% more efficient by size and also have virtually no chance of just exploding. This could be transformative for a lot of consumer electronics and things like electric vehicle adoption and safety. There was a bunch of research into solid state batteries years ago, but it kind of fizzled out because nothing really worked. But this company has been giving prototypes to the military and to a couple of private tech firms that have not been identified both of which are giving good feedback. So you might have your very own power crystal soon in several years. Power crystals, power goo.